Hey guys, me and you again, your favorite Canadian YouTuber, eh? And today, I'm gonna be playing a game called Shantae and Asha. This is a fan-made game created by X Buster, and from the looks of it, he put a lot of time and effort into it. In fact, just recently, he contacted me on Twitter to personally thank me for supporting him, and I told him that I would do my own gameplay of this, and hopefully I could bring it to a lot more people's attention. As you may know, I'm a huge fan of Shantae, but I've also played a bit of Monster Hunter 4. I, I mean Monster Quest 4, sorry. Believe it or not, I actually got Monster Quest 4 for free via Xbox Live. After playing it for a bit, mm, it was a little cryptic at first, but eventually I got used to it, and all in all, it's a pretty good game. Might not have gave me that same fun feeling as Shantae, but still good. Now this is a game where both of these worlds are about to collide. Will all of X Buster's passion and hard work have paid off? Well, we're about to find out. Now keep in mind, I have never played this game before, so this is my genuine raw first experience playing this game, and I have no idea what to expect. Alright, enough talk. It's time to start this new adventure and play this game right now. Huh. Uses the, the Monster, Monster World 4, 4 engine, engine, huh? Okay. okay. By the way, I'm playing this using an uh, USB SNES controller. Oh, uh, oh, is this, like, uh, the end of Monster World 4? Well, I haven't played through the entire game. Matter of fact, I, uh, in fact, I, I'm not sure if, I think I've only played, like, the first level so far, or first two levels, so I'm probably gonna be, uh, a little spoiled from the ending of that game. Not a big deal. I need to press to skip to the next piece of dialogue, or does it just go on its own at this pace? Then, huh? So I'm guessing this is more connected to the uh, Monster World 4 story or timeline than it is Shantae. Hmm, interesting. Hmm, not quite over yet, huh? Okay. Is this where the game begins? Oh! Now we're in Skelltown. So far, so good. Mm. Is it that voice from the genie realm? Mm. Strangers, uh, or how about strange voices coming out of nowhere? Ah, uh, one of those, huh? By the way, sorry if my voice is uh, not very clear or loud enough. Oh. Is it a... is it a portal to smash? <laughs> Good thing, Enchante. Well, it's not like you have most of the time throughout your past games. Yeah, to be honest, I'm not. Re I myself am not really good with situations where I have little to no time to decide. I always need time to think. Yeah, it's one of those uh, Monster Hunter 4 styled uh, decision things. Either uh, are you ready? Yes, I'm not ready. Press it. 
that much I know to say the least after playing a bit of the game. <clears throat> State of dreams. Yeah, I don't understand it either. Looks like she might as well just go with it. Hmm. By the way, I forgot to mention, this screen recorder I'm using can only record up to 5 minutes, so in about 15 seconds I have to stop it, then, uh... Sorry folks, my uh, computer screwed me over, and I missed a cutscene. I really hope this doesn't happen again, but I can't guarantee. Hmm. Hmm, now I can start the game. Ah, classic. What's this? Oh, full-on voice acting, huh? Hmm, alrighty, this looks promising. What's this? Hey, question, next buster. Uh, who does the voice acting? Because, uh, so far, it's uh, pretty good. And the classic music I can see. Hmm. By the way, it turns out you uh, hold the attack, uh, I mean, jump button in order to make dialogue go faster. I'm hmm. oh, bringing that up, huh? One of those situations, huh? Oh, that uh, took a dark turn. That took a dark turn fast. <laughs> ah, I see. Well, uh, well, as far as I know, she's uh. She has been knighted by the Queen, and she seems to know her quite well, so, uh... Hmm. Maybe she can help her out? Who knows? Hmm. Much as I love a good story in a game, uh... Well, man, there's quite a few of these to go through, uh... And I'm not sure how much this, uh, thing I'm using can record. Uh, goal has been updated. Eh, uh, kinda like in Zelda Breath of the Seas. You complete one part of the quest, and then you get to the next part before it's finally complete. Wait, were those the books from the Shantae series? What's this? Because yeah, those look like the same sprites as the uh, books from the Shantae series. Could be wrong. Oh, does everyone have a voice here? Oh, she is gonna see the queen. Off to see the wizard! Sorry if that was a little out of context. <laughs> okay, that's fine. It's claiming that my computer is, uh, out of space, even though I'm pretty sure it isn't. But luckily, I've deleted some crap and made some room on my, com on my computer, so hopefully I shouldn't have this problem again. And it should actually record a solid five minutes this time. Oh well, yeah, off repair to the sacred statue. Uh, I remember this. Ugh. 
something, even though I haven't played much of the game yet. But I do remember this for sure. And the cows, of course. Yeah, I gotta say, X Buster definitely put a lot of effort into this, uh, just from the way it's designed. It's pretty well designed, I must say. Munch. You know, you know, funny story. Uh, this actually kind of reminds, I don't know why, just the words munch munch remind me of this, but uh, my friend uh, Charlie uh, on his YouTube channel, my name is Charlie, he actually uploaded a video of his experience playing Fallout 76, and uh, and uh, because there was no push to talk button, uh, there was a guy eating chips into his microphone. <laughs> I'm gonna get up there, and uh, and he was putting text on the screen to describe it, uh, and it and it said uh, munch munch, and then he said my face and unimpressed face. I know I'm not making any sense of it really, but if you go look at the video, you'll see what I mean, because some things are better seen than explained. Pepe, like Pepe the Frog. <laughs> I'm guessing this is something from Monster Quest Four. Uh, Monster World Fart. Why do I keep saying that? And, uh, I'm guessing this is something from the game that I haven't seen yet. Huh. Yeah, the classic coins there. Who's this? Oh, a grandmother. Earthquake, huh? Oh, man, that's uh, that's a harsh thing to think about. Why can't I go in? Earth. Oh, it's just a torch. Munch, munch, but he's sleeping. Is he sleep eating? What? Oh! I don't know if this is something from Monster World 4 or not, because I, uh. Once again, I've only played like the first one or two levels, so. Huh. Oh, she, uh. She, uh, speaks while, uh, while jumping. Don't remember that from the game. Uh, once again, I think this is something that X Buster uh, put in. Oh, you definitely do a good job putting it together, that's for sure. I gotta say, for a fan made game, this is actually really well designed. It could also be passed off as an official game. Or would you not go that far? Of course, uh, I think uh, I think we can all agree that a lot of people seem to underestimate what. Uh, what fans can do in terms of making games. Some of them actually make games even better than the official ones. Have you ever played a Bubbles Big Adventure? And again, I'm sure you've heard me mention it like a million times on this channel for years. <laughs> but for a good reason. Oh, okay, that was a little off. Oh, just barely made it. I will get that chest. Wait, wait, can I climb the trees? No, I don't think I can. At least not while holding this thing. Ah, crap. Well, I gotta reset the camera in about 10 seconds anyway. You think I should just leave it for now? Sorry about that, folks. Right now, my computer is going through quite a few technical difficulties, and I'm a little exasperated right now, so let's just get this over with. Oh, don't get me wrong, this is, a, this is a great game and all, but I guess I'm just not in the current form of excitement that I was like an hour ago, and to restart my whole computer and whatnot. Hopefully what else this game has in store should cheer me up. It is I. Oh hey, it's one of those uh, save guys. I'm starting to feel a little better. 
even though I had to uh, restart the entire game after restarting my computer. It's good to know this has a save feature so I won't have to play through the entire first part of the game again. That's uh, good to know. Anything to see or do up here? Wait. Well, I'm not gonna waste any more time jumping around here. I've got a whole game ahead of me. And I'm not gonna be playing the whole game, just some of it. I wanna see if I can at least uh, complete a level or chapter if there is one. Lots of cows here. Yeah. There are cows off the castle missing. Well, at least the cows serve uh, some greater purpose other than just to sit there and uh, go munch munch. Oh, another side quest? Okay. Okay, already this is starting to look good. She can punch? Huh. Whoa, that's actually really cool. Is it me, or do those blobby things actually look like the choo-choos from Zelda Breath of the Wild? Has anyone ever noticed that? Again, not many people have played the original Monster Hunter 4, so maybe not. Huh? I'm gonna say this is uh, it's actually pretty cool. Uh, oh man, those mushrooms are annoying as heck. And now I have a short range punch attack that just uh, makes it even more. Obnoxious. Wait a minute. Uh, I haven't played much of Monster Hunter 4, uh, Monster World 4, why do I keep saying Monster Hunter? But I do know that the mushroom things, every time you defeat them, they always drop a heart, so at least there's some reward to defeating them. Yeah, don't worry, I'm not going to keep overriding the same ones over and over again, uh, just occasionally when I need to. And I haven't made it uh, that far, so I guess it's a good thing that's pretty generous with the uh, with the with the save guys. Oh no, it's the werewolves! I hate those things. Wait, I I punch his fist and it hurts him. Wait, it said there was a way to equip the sword and shield and whatnot, but I forget how. Oh, is it me? Are the wolves in this game actually easier to defeat than the ones in the actual game? I'm not complaining or anything. Gotcha. Yeah, once again, I really like the voice acting. Did uh, did someone you uh, collaborate with uh, do this, X-Buster? Because it's really good. Unfortunately, I have to turn off the thing in about 10 seconds. Let's see if I can defeat this guy in the time it takes. Yep. Alright. <sighs> so, uh, while I was pausing, I figured out how to equip items. And now I got the sword, the shield, and whatnot. Ah, crap. Oh, thankfully, there's a heart there. Ah, oh. well, that's just me. 
Sorry if it looks like the frame rate's running a little laggy, it's probably just the screen recorder I'm using, not the actual game. Synthesize. Hmm, that's an interesting new feature. Nearby. Huh. So far, interesting. Huh. It looks like I already got a synth crystal or whatever. Huh? Well, it looks like I can, because I only have one, I can only get the what's in the one here. Tech power. Wait, let's try it. This looks the most promising. What? Am I not hitting the right button? Oh, yeah. Oh, I get it. Oh, well, now I feel like an idiot. I guess when this is the only one I can get then. Wasted almost three so far. Hmm. Shall I go in? Oh, hey, I just saw a cow standing on top of the castle door. It is I! It is I! <laughs> oh, I like this guy's voice. I don't know why. It is I! Ah, oh, crap. Did I hit the wrong one again? Okay. Okay, chose a different file just in case. And continue. Yeah. Mm, I remember the castle doors. Another chest. Shake it, baby. Five minutes already? Nah, just four. Oh! Shante! Oh my! <laughs> yeah. Not sure if uh, if a lot of people or not a lot have actually been uh, actually been saying that about Shante's ears. Very sensitive. Yeah. 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 I heard some people uh, saying that uh, that Shantae and Link might be the same species. <laughs> Back to the village? Hmm. Well, uh, I guess it means I can't explore any more of the area. And I guess that's uh, not a big problem. Who are you? Why are they putting question marks over her? That we already know who she is. Or do they not? Are we seeing this from her perspective now? Yeah, 
she's a long way from Sequin Land. I don't think we're in Sequin Land anymore. Yeah, that's another Wizard of Oz reference. Oh, so this is like one of those uh, RPG sort of things where people join your party. Are we getting any more? No, I think I remember seeing a little beta clip of Shovel Knight in this game. Will he join the party? Oh. <laughs> I think I'm starting to get a little sick here. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a mini game. Oh, I missed one, and I missed three. Wait, was I supposed to go in there? I have no idea. Man, these controls. Uh... No, no, it's not the game. It's just the controller I'm using. The controls are a little stiff. I'm trying to start a question why I chose just the controller in the first place. Well, uh, depends on what you mean. I mean, both of the worlds, uh, revolve around Middle Eastern culture. So, uh, are they technically in the, in the same region? Or, or in an alternate universe of the same Middle Eastern regions? I don't know. Huh. So, uh... Is it fate that brought them together? Or that mysterious voice that just told Chante to go with it? <coughs> yeah, I think I'm getting sick. Ah, uh, can't wait to see how she responds to this. I am Iron Man. Not sure if I built that up right, but you get it. Yeah, I think, uh... Oh yeah, because, uh, Asha, she actually has met a genie. I remember seeing that in the game. Huh. Maybe her genie friend can help her get back to see her mom in the genie realm or something? Bumpy ride. <coughs> Sorry if that sounds a little gross, but I think I'm getting sick. Oh, are we getting to the opening credits? Well, I guess now might be a good time to start. Well... Well, that was good. So, that was my first time playing Shantae and Asha. Was it as good as I hoped it would be? And did all of X-Buster's hard work pay off? HECK YEAH! I've only just begun playing this game, and already it's amazing how much attention to detail went into this. X-Buster has really outdone himself. I'm even willing to go as far as to say it's even better than the original Monster World 4. Although, once again, I haven't played much of the game, so maybe I'm a little too quick to judge. Well, either way, I highly recommend playing this. If you're a fan of either Shantae or Monster World, or if you like retro 2D side-scrolling platforms in general, as well as a good engaging story in a game, then this game is for you. So do yourself a favor and check out this game.
game. Right now, it's not getting a whole lot of recognition, and all the time and effort Xbuster put into this should not go to waste. So please support Xbuster by spreading the word about this game. Tell all your friends about it, both online and in real life. Share this game on as many social medias as you can. If you have the time, create your own Let's Plays of this game and share them with the world. Do everything you can to ensure that the world knows about Xbuster's work of art known as Shantae and Asha! Sorry if that was a little too dramatic. Anyway, I'll give you links to Xbuster's Twitter and YouTube channel, as well as a link to where you can download this game in the description below.